despite the Statistical Institute of Belize admitting that the Belize City area presented the most issues during the census data gathering, Director General Diana Castillo Trejo said that CIV is confident everyone was either counted or otherwise accounted for. She did also admit that there were persons reporting that their household was not visited during the census, but she added that after checks were made, someone else from the household had been questioned. Yes, it is true. The, the aim of the census is to reach every single household and get information on every single person. Um, in reality, for various reasons, you don't get to reach every single household. Um, what we can say, however, is that we made every effort to, one, make adjustments for households where we didn't get a response. Um, and I will also say that with respect to persons who um, indicated that they themselves did not have any contact with the enumerators, um, you have to remember that you know the census is one data collection exercise where we allow proxy responses. So you just need one responsible or one knowledgeable adult from the household that can answer on everyone else. Um, there, there were some instances, and so we're speaking anecdotally, where persons did um, report to us anecdotally that no one went to their house and, and when we checked um, the details of that particular dwelling, someone else was interviewed. So, you know, it, it could be that, it could be um, Belize City was one of the areas where it was most difficult to find persons at home because we were advised not to work late hours and, um, you know, in the evening, in the night is when you find working people at home. So that was a, a challenge of its own. Um, but we, we feel confident that we know where the households are that we might not have reached and that we made the appropriate adjustments so that the final counts and the final estimates reflect those households as well.